The LSU women's rugby team was absent for 15 years, but now it's making a comeback. When I came here in 2000, the LSU women's team was just kind of finishing up. They had a really good run. Sarah Drake is the coach for the team. She's been on the Louisiana women's rugby team for nine years now. Uh, we realized that we needed to get a college team started. Essentially, they're younger, they're faster, they're stronger. So we wanted to get them started here at LSU. We were finally able to get the ball rolling, and it's, it's starting off a little rocky, but I think it's going to be a successful program here. Amy Wardeen was chosen to lead the new crop of women. She's the vice president and captain of the team. And we had a really strong board last year that really set, set the foundation for us, and this year just kind of continued what uh, the group last year started for us. Uh, we're always looking for new players. Whether you know anything about rugby, it doesn't really matter. One of those new players is Angelina Boscovich. Boscovich was recruited to LSU to play softball, but turned to rugby when a knee injury ended her career. I couldn't imagine playing another sport other than rugby because of the family aspect and knowing that the girls next to me are willing to do absolutely anything for the girls next to them. Coach Sarah Drake says the heart, not the skill that separates the LSU women's rugby team from every other program in the country. But talk about a group of women that just do not stop. Their calf's cramping, they're playing through it. You know, my knee hurts, they're playing through it. Coach Drake says she hopes to pass her love of the game down to the women she now coaches. I've never been so nervous playing but when these girls take the field I get more nervous. Their successes are their successes and their failures are my failures. Max Hawkins, Tiger TV Sports.